what have I learned in the past 106 days about vlogging? Hmm. I mean, for one, it's still kind of weird to carry a camera around everywhere you go. So sometimes, and I've got to admit it, I just don't. Look, I mean, at the end of the day, there's a lot of difficulties and challenges that come with vlogging in general, especially vlogging every single day. I mean, the obvious one is that it takes a lot of time and there's some days when you just have so much to do and it's so jam-packed that at the end of the day, all you really wanna do is just crash out on the couch and watch some, you know, mindless show. The reality is that you can't. I'm glad that I sort of challenged myself to vlog for 365 days and, and say it out loud and, and make a public sort of proclamation that I'm gonna do that because it, it holds me accountable. I think that if I didn't, then I would have easily taken an easy way out at some point and just stopped. So Josh um, asked a question, I think it was on one of the quick fire episodes about what is the goal of the channel? What is, where do I want the channel to go? Man, to be honest with you, I have no idea. And and I kind of like that. I mean, truthfully, I, I think what's amazing and, and part of the reason why I wanted to do it daily is I wanted to see how the channel evolved. I wanted to see um, where it ended up and, and, and what it turned into. I mean, you know, it's interesting. I mean, while it still serves as the medium for me to tell a story uh, that I enjoy the most or a cool way for me to create something special for my family or, or a place for, you know, people that are potential, you know, business referral partners or just you know, business partners um, to get to know who I am and to ultimately become more connected with people. I think that it's exciting to see how some videos get more views than others. The bottom line is I, I really enjoy, um, I really enjoy this. You know, I know, God, man, God bless my wife for being supportive and, and um, tolerant because I know sometimes truthfully full disclosure it does get in the way it's like I have to edit in, in the evenings after all is said and done and some days I find myself so busy you know driving or, or putting in so much um, kind of work and, and, and all of that that as just like a one-man show I haven't filmed anything and it's like holy cow I gotta you know what am I gonna talk about tonight so um, you know that's challenging it's cha you know while I don't let the view count of videos really affect me that much it still kind of affects me you know I really have that goal of by the end of Q2 uh, having 500 subscribers at least kind of growing that and, and going from there so to answer your question Josh I don't know you know the broad answer is this channel is a way for me to let the world know who Woody Brown is and what matters to me the most and I'm obsessed with stories and either watching them or, or even listening to them and and I think that's why songwriting was such an important piece of my life and and um, I think this has for now filled that void um, I'm gonna go ahead and say this and Sorry. duty calls one second Hey, good afternoon, this is Woody. Yes, um, I was calling about homeowners um, insurance. Yes, ma'am. Uh, I can help you with that. Is this for a new home purchase? Yes. All right, when does the uh, the home close? Uh, 